This is Get Genie, an AI copywriting tool working directly in your WordPress editor. And yes, it's compatible with Elementor. Now I've tested more than 30 different AI copywriting tools and Get Genie does it a little bit different. But can we write a blog post with Get Genie that we believe will rank on Google? Let's dive in and find out. What we normally see from AI copywriting tools is that they build a web platform, then they have their tools on the web platform, and then you can generate content in the platform, and then you can distribute it out on the different social medias, your website, and so forth. And then down the line, they either develop a browser extension or a WordPress plugin. Now, Get Genie has done this completely different. Even though they have a web platform, that's not where you generate your content. You generate all the content in your WordPress website. Now, this can limit a lot because if you have a Squarespace website, a Wix website, or a custom-built website, then you can't necessarily use Get Genie. So that's the pros and cons by doing it in this way. But if you are using WordPress, then Get Genie is brilliant for generating content. But let's try and dive into the different tools because they have more than 35 different AI tools to generate content. And the blog wizard is what I've used the most with the genie mode as well. But when you dive into the blog wizard mode, then you start out with a keyword. And of course, you want to start out with a long tail keyword. And the longer your keyword is, the less of a chance there is for Get Genie to have data on that specific keyword. So I feel like the analysis that they do of the keyword itself is limited and we can't use that for much. And when we take a look at the competition and the questions asked, then for the competition part, they are basically scanning the SERP and then they're finding one competitor. And I feel this one is lacking. I would like to see 20 competitors because when we want to write an article that we want to rank, we need to see what's already working for the top 10 and even top 20. And then we need to take and combine some of those headings, some of the content. So we write our own article that will rank for that specific long tail keyword. And if we only get one competitor and we base our entire article on that specific competitor, the output will just not be great. So I would really like to see more competitors. And for the questions, I feel it's a mix of AI generated questions and people also ask section from Google. Of course, we only want the questions asked on Google, the AI generated questions we can use for inspiration, but to use it as a foundation in our article, I do not find that very relevant. Another thing I noticed with this blog wizard module is the search intent. It's very much hit and miss. Sometimes it understands the search intent, other times it's just completely off. And we can really see that in the content generated because what's important when you use the blog wizard is you choose whether your content should be targeted worldwide or specific countries. And if it's specific countries, then either choose English as a language or the native language in that country. Of course, it depends on your website. But the search intent is so, so important to get right, especially on Google. So I think they should really work on the search intent. It's so important to get right, whether you focus on navigational, informational or transactional. And often when we build these blog posts, it's either informational or transactional. If you're a web shop or if you're an e-commerce website and you want this article to sell specific products, then in theory it is transactional because the end goal is to get them to visit specific products that the article is talking about. And I feel this entire search intent is so important that maybe they should add an extra field telling this specific algorithm, is it transactional, navigational, or is it informational? But what I'm missing with this blog wizard is the ability to create an entire blog post in one go. Right now, I can generate a title, I can generate an introduction, and then I can generate an outline. And then I can insert that into my post, and then I'm left there. What I have to do then is I have to, for each section, go in and use the write for me, which is the function from Get Genie. And then I have to insert each of my headings into Get Genie to get a text out. And often this text is just completely off because 
they don't have the entire context of the article. So what I feel they need to change is the ability to create an entire article. Because when we have the outline, they will be able to do this automatically for us, where they take each section and generate some text for us. They can even do a scale nut does, where they give us some short lines of what direction the AI algorithm is going into. And then we can always change that so we get in the direction we want to, whether it's transactional or informational in this case. I think that's really something that would level up this plugin and it will make it so much faster to generate an article because now not only is the output not great, but it also just takes too much time to generate an article. Of course, it's still faster than manually sitting down and writing an article. And I think overall, that is the problem with AI. If we write it manually, we will be able to use our own experience and in the end, we'll end up with just a better article, but the AI can help us move past this writer's block. So if you feel yourself writing and you just don't know what to write about, then an AI algorithm and especially Get Genie is great to inspire you and tell you what you can write about for the specific subjects in your outline. But if you know already what to write about, then you can still use the AI for filling out the empty holes and just helping you get along to get to those 1000 words or how many words it is you want to write in your article. So I think it has specific use cases depending on where you are. Now, as mentioned, they have a lot of different tools, 35 to be precise, and they do also have a featured snippet tool, but right now they only have it as a listicle. I would really like to see a single answer target featured snippet because there are so many questions out there we could answer. Of course, with ChatGPT and Google's new AI, all of these questions will be able to be answered by AI in the future, but the more complex questions, we could really win some featured snippets if this AI from Get Genie was able to generate this content. But now this article I have generated, do I believe that it will be able to rank on Google? It will definitely not be able to rank, especially not on page one or page two. Of course, it will try and rank for some long tail keywords that I don't even know of. But the quality of this content generated is just too far out. We're missing the search intent. We're missing a red thread through the entire article. You can really see that the content is generated for the specific sections and the conclusion also just doesn't conclude the entire article. It only concludes what I have written into the AI tool. So I feel all of these points are extremely important in order to rank on Google. And this is just missing from Get Genie. Again, to refer back to ScaleNut, ScaleNut is really doing this in a great way where they have the same steps as Get Genie, but they just take it a step further and generate the entire article for you. But if you want to start out with Get Genie, I will really encourage you to do so because you can start for free to use Get Genie. As mentioned earlier, they have different use cases. On top of that, if you really like using Get Genie, then their tools and their plans are also cheaper compared to ScaleNut and Phrase, especially when you come up into the higher plans. But the future elements they're working on, to me, which are exciting is the FAQ element, where you'll be able to generate an entire FAQ based on the questions from the SERP. But before they step into this, I hope they will be able to fetch better questions from Google because sometimes the questions were just off and they were not relevant for my search term. And on top of that, then they're working on a plagiarism checker. So we will be able to check our entire content generated by AI, whether it has been used before or not. And I hope that they will add an AI checker as well, because this is something that's very relevant now. So Google will tell you whether this is AI generated or not. I think if they can add a tool like this, it would really bring some value to also the plagiarism checker. But all of these tools are really nice, but what I think they should focus on is the search intent and then better generated output. And I think the output can really be improved if they look at the search intent, if they try to generate an entire article where they have this common thread through the entire article and they can generate a conclusion based on the article and not based on some short description that I give that specific tool. But all this said, you will definitely be able to create and generate articles with Get Genie and make them rank on Google, but they need a human touch. It, you can't just 
generate an article, publish it on Google, and just sit back and wait. You will have to add your own experiences, make a little touch up on the article here and there, add images and so forth if you really want it to rank, because it's just a raw article you get out. And based on all of this, I want to give Get Genie three and a half stars. They still have way to go, especially on the output, but I really like to see that it's a WordPress plugin because often that's not what we see first. We see the website first. But if you want to see my review of Scalenot, which I've mentioned a couple of times, then you can do that right up here. Thank you for watching. See you on the next one.